Hi guys! My name is Anna. If you're new here, if you're not new here, welcome back. Thank you for returning. So today is going to be a bit of a different video. What you guys are about to see is how we clean my makeup brushes with the Style Pro system. If you guys like this kind of beauty content, let me know. I want to make more videos like this for you guys. So let's get into this video. Let's get into cleaning our brushes finally. I am using the Cell Pro brand. So I have the I have more water in the bowl to help clean the brushes. And then also for my budget, um, my girls on the bu on a budget, I use um BB shampoo, but there is style. There is a cleaner that is seventeen dollars. That is that is from the brand um the style pro brand, but it says not to use water when you're using the, the, the cleanser that comes with it. And I'll have, we can always link these products down below. So right now, Maddie and I are trying to figure out which ends or which, which holder it goes in, or what, what is the appropriate size for the brush to go in, because you don't want you want the brush to be secure because it will sh spin and shake, um, or spin when it's cleaning. So you want it to be secure. And Maddie's always my little assistant. Okay, so you are gonna see me on the struggle bus, and this is me trying to do it myself. But obviously, I fail at that. So. Enjoy my struggles. Okay, so Maddie is coming in here to save the day like usual. And so I'm, so I hold in the water. Oh my god, okay, I hold in the water. And then what we found to be the easiest, and you guys might want to do this too, um, is she cleans it and or spins it out spins it dry in the sink because the system does it where it spins on that little thing that I'm holding so it's like the motor okay so we figured out eventually that the smaller brushes were cleaner so and another tip for you guys is bigger brushes like your foundation brush or um your blush brush oh my god say that five <laughs> say that five times fast but your blush brush um it slows down the motor this is not the fun part of putting on makeup Okay, here's us doing the third brush, which is the one that I use most often, so I figured that it would be the most dirty. The, yeah. Anyway, and it apparently it was not that dirty, it was very clean, which I was very proud of. But, <laughs> um, it's, we had a struggle getting that in. So, but looks like I won't get any diseases from me. Okay, by diseases I also mean um like germs and not like diseases, just for clarification. And also, I do not clean my brushes as often as I probably should 
just because of um it takes a long time too long for uh, on a girl here and yeah i do not have patience for that so we're gonna just roll with it no pun intended but yeah Okay, girls and or boys and girls, I am now cleaning my beauty or my foundation brush, which this is the he one of the heavier brushes. And anyway, so we figured out that the um the foundation brush is very clean, but there was one corner or one section, little section of it that was still a little dirty. We are currently using my beauty blender more frequently than my um foundation brush. So there's not really anything on my foundation brush. Here we are trying to um, get my highlight brush in its spot, and Maddie is being my little ha or my hands like usual. <laughs> and that we didn't show this part, but it was quite a struggle. It's my um, the right sizing. Okay, folks, we get to, we finally get to uh, do my blush brush, and boy, do the clouds of pink come, let me tell ya. So, I'll, I'll let you guys see that. Okay, so the first thing I go over is the brush connectors, which are the little full things I'm holding up in the camera. But, um, they attach it to the system, which is the motor thing. And, um, each one you want to make sure that it's secure enough where it can be movable, but also not fall out this system and the motor actually comes with um double a wait you have to put double a batteries i'm not sure if it comes with double a batteries i know on the i can't remember my system did but yeah moving on to my um the cheap version of cleaner which is baby shampoo yeah it's just baby shampoo with the warm water the warm water helps the, br the bristles from your brushes so I would definitely recommend doing it more from warm water or with warm water and they only need a couple of drops because the the motor will make it is it bubble up or is it okay the motor will make it bubble up and that will be it and yes I'm using my table my table mate so for any wheelchair folks I would recommend you get a table mate because that has helped me in so many um situations in life and like with 
I use it on Christmas Day. I use it on my brunch every day. Then I know that I can't reach the table. So definitely, I recommend for special needs people. On of recommendations. So the purple ones at the and then are real techniques. Would definitely recommend those. Um, for any of, of you. And then all my rest members are Sephora brand. Um, but the pink one is the the um magnetics. Okay, one last thing. Yeah, Maddie is trying to show the residue that's from the look, and then the water did not get too dirty, but um, it got enough dirty. It was the clouds of pink, like you guys saw. Okay, that concludes this video. Thanks for watching, and remember to keep on rolling. See you guys next time. Bye.